Hi everybody, I'm going to be showing you how I do my makeup, starting with my hair and curling it with my straighteners. Just going to get myself all comfy and ready to start. This is the before. I'm going to start with a lip scrub. I don't really do this often, but I decided to do it today. Now I'm going to prep the base of my face with a primer. I quite like to use the Maybelline one. It's the like white and blue bottle. Make sure you also bring it down to your neck. Next up we have brows. I've only actually just started using the MAC brow pencil and it's completely changed the game. Like it's so much better than powder. I quite like using a liquid eyeshadow just because I'm lazy and it's so easy to rub in just with your fingers. Now to the eyeliner, I've literally been using four years, <laughs> probably since I was like 16, Maybelline again, and it does not fail me. Now this is the Maybelline mascara that was all over TikTok, the sky high one, and everybody loves it, and to be honest with you, I do too. <laughs> I've been using this ever since, it's just my go-to. Now for some concealer, I've always used the Bobbi Brown one in Light Bisque. You can also wear this without any foundation and it does just kind of elevate your face a bit to make it look like you've made a bit of an effort, but just not loads. Moving on to foundation. Now I've never, ever, ever been a makeup girly and it was actually a lady in one of those big department stores that tried this on me and I've never had a foundation that looked just so natural. It's like an in real life filter. Now moving on to contour, just getting the excess off my brush and I'm going to start placing it just on my cheekbones. I'm also going to start kind of taking it up and around my face as well, just to give me a bit more colour. I'm a bit pale. <laughs> now it's time for blush, so just getting the excess off my brush again. I'm going to start placing that just above the contour, um, but kind of blending it in as well at the same time. I'll also put a little bit on my nose, a bit across my forehead and just kind of give me a bit of colour from my face. Now onto powder, I've always used this Bobbi Brown one. I don't know why, it's just the one I'm comfortable with. I'm also using the Trick Royal Cosmetics Powder Press. It takes away the shine, but it does also keep my makeup in place. So I'm just gonna pat it all on there. So I'm putting this under my eyes, on my T-zone, and also where my contour is. So I did a first layer of mascara earlier. I do kind of wait a bit of time, and then I do a second layer. Just to mention, I did also use a clean brush just to wipe off any excess powder, just so it didn't look cakey. And this is the final result. I think it's cute. It's Basically the version of me I think I wake up looking like in the morning. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed. Bye!